get a chance to see these two teams match up often, but they're always fun when they do. Hi, everybody. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro for this EA Sports Interconference Showdown. Opening face-off just moments away. The Islanders take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Slides it over with pace to Rust. New York's on the attack. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Goligoski. And that's knocked away by Neal. New York's got the puck. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. On the doorstep. Can't connect. Edmonton's got the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Appleton. Puck picked up by Tierney. Feeds it on over to Appleton. From the point, they take control of it. Nelson's got it in the defensive end. And that doesn't exactly go tape to tape. Taken along the wall by Fogel. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Neal's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Edmonton's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Just because the power play hasn't had a success run here, you can't focus in on that. You can't try to do too much. He scores! Always good to get on the board. Get the monkey off your back early. Quick shot on the first attempt, but that rebound came right back to him. And he's able to settle it and put it into the net before anyone else can stop him. New York's got a 1-0 lead, and they've got their crowd on their feet here. Early on, the entertainment is here. Early lead for the home team, the first goal in the first five minutes, and now you push for another. And that's poked away by Neal. New York's looking to break out. Neal's got it on the offensive end. James, he's only one goal away. He scores! Wow! Coast to coast! Snakes his way through the entire team. Head up, looks at his options, decides he's the best option, and finishes it off. This makes the coaches look smart every time. They depend on him for offense. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Islanders have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Taken by Barry. Moves it to Ryan. Here's a chance. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Nelson's got it into offensive territory. Picked up along the boards by Neal. With the blast. Oh, what a stop. Great heads up play to poke it away in the offensive end. Edmonton's got it in their own zone. On the attack along the boards. Looks to set up at the point now. Ottinger's going to elect for the face-off and maybe just a chance to play with the puck a little. Well, you get to feel it for sure, but he hasn't had much to do at all. His team's been in control as they lead this game. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. Scooped up along the wall by Nurse. And now he tries to get it across to Tierney. The Islanders gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Off the puck, it is enough, they score! He beat him with the quick release there, James. That thing hits the post, sure, but it's his release that gets that puck away too quickly for the goalie. The Oilers win the faceoff. Slides it up front. Takes a shot with the stop. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Now he slides it up to Neal. And they won't connect on that one. 
Pucks sent down the ice. We'll get an icing. Neal's played so well in this point streak, you know he wants to pile on it. Neal's really good at losing defenders, but he uses that spinorama zone ability to turn away from them. And that's his way of opening up some space to create better plays, guys. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. They'll be back on their heels. They lose the draw after they've iced the puck. They're a little tired. Grabbed along the boards by Nelson. Poked away by Smith. With the blast! Comes up with the stop! And that's broken up. The Islanders carry it along the wall. Couldn't complete the pass. And that's poked away by Rust. Picked up along the wall by Appleton. Through center along the wing. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Breakaway! Denied! I don't know what more could be done there. That's a good shot, but the goalie makes a great stop. Scores! Bar down for the goal! Man, he walks right into this one-timer and hammers it. Hits the bottom of the crossbar. The goalie's got no chance as it bounces in. More than half the period has expired. New York's latest goal has now given them a four-goal lead. Puck grab by Neal. The Islanders take it from the side. Neal's got it along the wing. With the blast. Makes the save on the snapper. Smith's going to cover it up and get a whistle. Even with the traffic starting to close in, he had to grab that when he did. McDavid's wheel zone ability means he can move past everyone with his great skating speed. Barzell's depended upon greatly by his teammates. He's one of the stars of this team and needs to produce night in and night out. I'm expecting one of these two players to be the biggest impact for their team tonight. Back to you guys. Cutting to the slot. And he's peeling off to regroup. Lugs the puck back into the neutral zone. Stoppage and play offside the call. Here in the late goings of the period, New York's put on an excellent display of firepower, leading 5-1. And now he moves it to Ennis. Takes the pass. Edmonton's got the puck against the half wall. And finally they respond with a goal. They just haven't been able to get anything going, and the more they try to score, the more they give up more defensively. They've given up a boatload of goals. Face-off looming as both centers get into position. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. The Islanders have it now. Explores his options behind the net. Picking up some steam at center ice. 18 minutes, 19 seconds. Neal's going to play it against the half wall. Wicked slap shot! And the goalie covers up for the whistle. And that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around. And we're about set to drop the puck here on period number two. Sends it quickly to Nelson. Takes the feed. Neal's... He scores! It's in! And that's the 
That's three, Ray! I think he's the most surprised guy in the building. Look at the way he reacted when that puck went into the net. Outstanding effort. Hey, sometimes you just can't keep up to the puck. That thing is zipped by the goaltender and into the net. The Islanders are on fire tonight here in the second. Domination right from the very beginning of the game. This is now an absolute landslide for them. Gets the puck in deep. The Islanders have it behind the cage. Puck moved over to Nelson. Pushes it across to Thompson. Can't connect on the pass. And no luck on that pass attempt. Takes a shot. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Here's a stretch pass to Neal. New York's playing it from the side. From the back of the cage with the puck. Handles a sweet feed. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. And there's another stop. Goalies love making the glove save, whether it's a great save or a rather run-of-the-mill one. They love to show you that they've caught it after they've put it away. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Scores! Oh, you know he knows 100 goals was on the horizon, and he's achieved that milestone. New York's offense firing on a ball. Is that fair to say? Yeah, they're going to have to change the netting in that other goal. Man, they are <laughs> firing the puck in there at will. It's getting frayed. Edmonton's won it. Moves the puck over to Appleton. And a stick breaks that up. Here they come on the attack. To his teammate. And the puck dies with the trapper save really like his positioning here as he's able to get the glove up there to make the save but it doesn't have to be a spectacular crazy save because he's in a good spot the islanders take possession off the face off stops him cold centering pass he scores when it rains it pours man they are just coming out in buckets right now as they get three straight Really a dominating performance. New York's been dominant tonight as they make their way back to center. They have scored almost a will in particular here in this second period. And now it's grabbed by Neal. Into the offensive zone. New York's got a hold of the puck now. Puck scooped up by Johnson. And here's the pass to Neal. That pass doesn't go. Puck picked up by Neal. Denied by Fleury. And now he angles it across to Dreisaitl. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Edmonton's got the puck along the wall. Aaron pass and they can't connect. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. McDavid's plate is getting a little fuller by the moment here. As the captain of this team, he's got to be the one to rally them. He's got to be the one to show them a way out of this mess they're in. Pushes it across to Nelson. Slides it diagonally to Neal. Drives it to the crease. Slides it to Ryan. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Ryan's taking it from his own end. Moves it to the offensive zone. Puck dumped in. New York's got possession of the puck. Sends one up to Neal. All alone! And it kind of falls apart here at the end. James, I'm going to assume he had a different idea about how that was going to finish up. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. Nugent Hopkins plays it now. 
and tries to make a diagonal pass to Ennis. The Oilers take it along the wall. Let's the wrister fly. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Can't get it to go. Neal's working it around in the corner. Oh, that's a big time save. I think he got it with a toe. Carries it across the line. Pass back to the point. Fantastic save! Ottinger's had to be on his game. That's a great chance. Both centers ready to take the draw here coming up. The Oilers win it. And he gets in the lane to block that. And now it's over to Neal. Unable to reach that one. He's got a jump here. Look at this. Oh, yeah. They'll wave off Look the icing. Look at him icing. go, James. Ray, unbelievable. Man, he, he gets all the way down the ice to clear that icing. Otherwise, face off in his zone. And that's off a stick. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. They go on the attack from the left side. Answers it with an even better save. And he can't find his man. Tried to connect the pass, but it doesn't go. Oh, hello. Comes up with the puck with a quick steal. Nice flick of the stick. He scores again. Well, you get one, you think you might get two, but after a while, you're like, hey, how many can I get? The puck keeps coming to him, and he keeps finishing it off. Really tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going. The Islanders have reminded me of that old cliche here, Ray. When you're hot, you're hot. It's a point night now. Everybody looking for points and goals as they are just clearly the better team tonight. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Scores! There's number 20 of the year! Yeah, solid production. You get past the milestone of 20, and you know you've had a good year. How many times do you hit that number? You know, I don't know. Yeah, 11, 12, 13, something like that. Let's count, right? Um, yeah, I don't know. Nicely it's a good, it's a good done. number. The goalie's probably got to stop this, but I don't think he's set, James. That turnover didn't give him much time to get set in the net. Teams are ready for the draw. The linesman about to drop the puck. Taken by Keith. From the right side, they gain the zone. Takes the feet at the back end. Blocked in traffic. He's got a step. Oh, he didn't have enough gas to get the shot off. Really good work by the defender to close the gap. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. Here's a short pass to Neal. Takes the feed. New York's got the puck along the boards. Chase right in front. Oh, tremendous athletic reflexes there with the toe stop. Sometimes you're in close, there's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Denies him with a save. Puck grabbed by Nelson. And now it's grabbed by Neal. Blocked in traffic. The Islanders gain control of the puck. New York's got possession here in the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by Nelson. 18 seconds left. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. Third period underway here. This has been a total squash to this point. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? New York's focus now is just lock down this game. Comfortable lead. They've been terrific through 40 minutes. Don't give it away now.
The Islanders get a hold of the puck in their own end. And that pass can't connect. And play continues here. Goes right to the crease. Denies them with the blocker. What a stop by Fleury. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. The Islanders played along the wing. Blast from the point. There's a great glove save by Fleury. Takes a bump but hangs on. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Ottinger's had a solid night here. His save percentage is really good while they've built a comfortable lead. Big stop by the goaltender right in front. Move to the middle. Receives the pass. Nelson's four points is just part of this onslaught. I mean, they are blowing the other guys out of the ring. And that shot gets caught in traffic. He scores! Uh, the old double dip makes this a fantastic night for you. You know it's your night. You're feeling it. And now he's got two. Oh, that's got to stink. He stopped most of this shot. But it's still got enough velocity to go into the net. The Islanders have not stopped the firepower display tonight. You impressed down there? It's like they're going downhill the whole game. The, their opponent hasn't been able to keep up at any level tonight. Cutting to the front of the net. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. Love save made by Ottinger. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. The setters will glide into the dot. The Islanders win it in the defensive zone. And now he tries to get it across to Neal. And that's a great heads up in the defensive zone to force the turnover. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Takes it to the net. Oh, bold move by the goaltender as he pokes it away. Quick pass to Dreisaitl. Handles it along the blue line. Here he is in close. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. But he came out and challenged him. Good save. Moves it quickly over to Bemstrom. And now he moves it to Gustafson. Looking to make something happen along the boards. New York's got a hold of the puck. Into the attacking area from the left side. All alone! There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. won the face off deep in their own end nice pass New York's got the puck along the wall and that doesn't exactly go tape to tape here's a rip stops the rocket of a shot denies the shooter on that play yeah he's pretty good positioning here James he makes the two stops back to back shot in front stopped by the goaltender sends the pass over Quick feed to Dreisaitl. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. Nelson scudded against the boards. And that one stopped. Dreisaitl's moving the puck through his own zone. Directed over to Hyman. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. The Islanders gain possession. New York's coaches are really making a determination who should be on the ice by the way it's going tonight. And that's the second line. They've been the best line in this game. Here he is with the backhander. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. The Capitals are on the save the date calendar next for these guys. Yeah, fans of both teams will really look forward to that matchup. It's generally a pretty aggressive game. Never an off night in this league. 
Nelson's won the faceoff deep in. They score! And the Islanders fans are on their feet tonight! Control of the faceoff by the offensive team allows them to snap it into position for the shot. The goalie's not set, and he gets beat on it. Centers glide into the dot as the faceoff ready to resume play. The Oilers win it. Barry's got the puck along the wing. Moves it to Ennis. New York's trying to gain a step. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. He scores! There's the hat trick, and here come the hats. Man, it is loud in here. The guy jumped up on the bench as soon as that third goal went into the net. New York's taking a playbook out of the Ray Ferraro School of Hockey here. Just be aggressive, goal when after goal. Man, when you score, go get another one. You've got the other team down, go get more because you make yourself feel better, you build your own confidence, and you put this thing on cruise control. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. The Islanders are on the attack. Neal's going to play it to the corner. Let's it fly from the point! And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. control of it now from their own end through center dumps it into the ozone Pellick's lugging the puck that's moved up ahead Neil's having fun tonight he's padding the assist column it seems on a regular basis moving the puck finding the open guy and going to celebrate as the thing ends up in the net again puck scooped up by Nurse quick pass over to Appleton the Islanders get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Picked off by Appleton. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Puck sent over to Neal. Can't find his man. From behind the net. The cannon from the point! He was locked in there. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. The Oilers take it across the line. Tries to feed it over to Rust. Dumps it in. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Unloads one. Oh, what a stop. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Rust. That's not going to fool him. One of the things he was working on is trying to control where the puck goes after he stops it. The corner is a pretty safe place. Fires it into the offensive zone. New York's gained possession along the boards. Takes it and looks ahead. Hammers the shot. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Looks like he picked up a knock here, James, but... Lots of times you can skate through the rest of your shift and you feel better. He's going to give it a go. Under siege and finally grabs that one and covers up for a whistle. Bemstrom's been looking for a way off the ice for a little bit of time on this shift. He was injured somewhere in the midst of it. He wants to get off the ice. Who had the better night? Carlin is standing by. Barzell's been great at generating offense, and I've been impressed with his game in this one, guys. Edmonton's got the puck in their own end. Pass to Dreisaitl. The Oilers scoop it up along the boards. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. And they can't connect. The Islanders play it along the boards. Offside the call will get a reset. 
Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. To the front! There's the horn, and it's time to breathe. Neil's performance is one that every single one of these fans won't soon be forgetting.